Durham, New Hampshire is the place to be on a homecoming Saturday, and a homecoming crowd might be exactly what the New Hampshire Wildcats need to help put their season back on track as they get set to host the U Albany Great Danes this afternoon from Wildcat Stadium. And as we get set for this one, we'll welcome you upstairs inside the broadcast booth where I'm happy to be joined by former UNH captain Brian Espinet. I'm Cameron Beal. Back to the same play. Tomlinson comes up with this time. Reaches across. Touchdown, Wildcats. Low to Caleb Burke. Couldn't quite catch it and go. They load up the left side here. Fourth and two. Brosmer keeps it as a seam up the middle. Tumbles down for a first down. Once again, loading up the left side. Anton Junkaj, the far defensive end for Albany. A.J. Simon, the near side. Junkaj breaks free. They get it to Lauby out of the backfield. Breaks two tackles, and he's got room to go. Spins out of another. Lauby scutters down for a first down. With the guy that's going to cover and bat the ball away. We just need that consistent pass rush to help these guys out back there. Brosmer, plenty of time. A man wide open. D.J. Lincolns nearly stumbles out and pushed out inside the 10-yard line to set Wildcats up with a first and goal. Big third down here. Third and 10 from the 27. Twins on either side of the formation. Woodell in the backfield. One hands the snap is Poffenbarger. Here comes Zidane Williams to the party. First and 10 from the 15. 7.43 and counting. Give to Lauby. Bounces left. Outrunning Larry Walker Jr. Has the edge down to the five thanks to a block from who other than Joey Corcoran. Tomlinson, the only receiver, split out to the left. Lauby deep in the backfield. Tomlinson in the backfield in motion. They were looking for him. In for the touchdown, Colby Ramshaw. Second touchdown on the season for the London Derry native. They'll test that 40 time one last time for you, Brian, and get <laughs> down there. 38-31 the final for New Hampshire. They come back from 10 points down in the second half to win this one and escape with their first conference win on the season. For Brian Espinette, I've been Cameron Beal, and thanks for watching here on Flow Sports.